today we got some unboxing to do. Uh, let's see what we got. Two boxes here. Um, who are they from, Sal? Man, I got my glasses. Let me see. It says the House of Rags. All right, House of Rags. Let's see what we got. So uh, we got a couple boxes here. We are literally just going to open them up and uh, see what they are. Let's see what these got in them. Hey, this is our first unboxing video, right? Shake that thing up. Shake it up. Shake it up. Why? I just want to see the. I just want to see the packaging. Oh, my man, doing a doing a real review. Yeah. Well, got some paper, 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 paper. Okay, everything as you can see, everything looks intact. That's a lot of stuff. It is a lot of stuff. The yeah, house of rags. Okay, go ahead, read that off. See what that is. See what we got there. Right. Go ahead, read it. Applicator pad. So I'm assuming this is uh, some ceramic. Uh, ceramic thick. Premium blend. Okay. You have to read faster than that, brother. Ceramic slim. Premium blend. We got a five inch wool pad. Five inch blueberry. Oh, I like that color. It's a nice color right there. Baby blue. Oh, I like this color too. Waffle. That's a nice blue. That's a nice blue, guys. And we got the sponge. Oh, wait. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. You still reading? No, we're good. Oh, okay. we're good. oh we got some bio bombs. Bevy grape. Air freshener bar. Crack that thing open. Bust that thing open. Where's the a knife? Where's it at? Over here. Where's it? Give you guys first hand uh, impression. Bio bombs, man. Bio bombs always doing it. Ooh. Always doing it. Ooh. Always doing it right. Mm. Shout out to bio bombs. Shout out to House of Rags. All right. It smells delicious. Yes, yes. Brother. We're keeping that one in the studio. Mm. Okay. Uh, here, let me put, I'm going to set these all out first, and then we're going to read through them. Man, I need my glasses, too. Okay. We have Dressing Guardian Detail Co. We're not going to read all the directions and all that stuff. You guys already know tire dressing type of stuff. Um, you know how that goes on. Uh, but we will read it before we use it, but we just don't want to, you know, we're, we're, right now. we're not talking about directions right now. We're just talking about initial reaction and unboxing. Uh, we have a Bugs Dirt and Exterior solution. So I'm guessing that's kind of like a, you know, like a, exactly what it says for Bugs Exterior, like the, the, the nasty shit. Throw that on it. Um, we have panel prep. It's always good to have panel prep, especially with the coatings. <laughs> to have, you know, they always say to get the panel prep from the same company because they usually formulate right, the system. something. Yeah, in always the follow the system. Um, some guys argue that, just like of anything course. else, you know. Your mic, your mic on? Yeah. Your new, your new mic on? We we'll link them in, them in the uh, description below. But thank you guys for uh, the recommendation. And uh, Papa Smurf, if you're watching, we actually use your affiliate account to buy them. So hope you got a little bit of change for that. Supporting the channel, like that's just how we do. And that's how, uh, you know, that's our way of giving back too. So if you guys wanna support us, we're gonna have the affiliate link and the, you know, for, for not only D, not only the House of Rags, but for the microphone. And then go ahead and throw Papa Smurf's YouTube channel on there in the link. Oh, I forget what is, what is it? Put it, but in Papa Smurf, Check him out. Find him. He's local to us. My man, I think he's in Davis? Somewhere close. He's close to us. He's local. So uh, shout out to Papa Smurf. So uh, we have Compound. So I'm guessing this is... Okay, so it says Grape. 
Okay, we're gonna we're gonna smell all of them after. I smell the tire shine. We should we should have did it with this. Well, paint prep smells like I'm paint sure prep, yeah. paint prep. Um, and then we have a sealant, a ceramic sealant. So those are what we have, fellas, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. That was the first box. So we got two hey, boxes. Real quick, we got a white cap, black cap. What do you think the reason for that is? Uh, I don't know. It could be like our last video where we were talking about PNS. There could be a shortage in oh the actual caps itself, or maybe they decided to switch them off, or maybe it's, it's just inconsistency, or it could be for certain types of chemicals like corrosives and stuff. I don't know. It could be color indicator. It could just be a mistake. Who knows? But um, and then of course, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put these to the side. Really, no no need to have these out. They're just the sprayers and the caps. It's nice to have sprayers and caps we've ordered stuff before where we didn't receive any sprayers or caps so it made it very difficult for us to use because pretty much got to go get your own wonder if that's a standard thing well it, it's becoming more and more more and more like standard to be sending the stuff but i remember before it was it was all you if you didn't get them like that was norm now if you don't get them people are kind of complaining all right so box number two What we got here? We got a gallon of something. What's that? What we got there? Probably, uh, let me guess. Let me guess. Uh, the, 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 the rinseless. That's probably what the rinseless is, right? Nope. No? That would have that been too, that would have been like overkill on the rinseless. <laughs> what is it normally like 256 to one? <laughs> be like, here's rinseless for, for, <laughs> for, like, for your forever. career. <laughs> um, no, this is a high pH soap. Again, these are becoming more and more popular, the high pH soaps. There's companies that, you know, PNS got their uh, Frostbite that we used yesterday. And then uh, you got Active Foam and you have, uh, Jimbo's even has the, the touchless one that he calls it. And uh, I'm a big fan of high pH soaps. So I, we're definitely gonna use this because it's so, it's so funny because, and this is what like we talk about guys, like this is why we like documenting ourselves and we're able to see what we said a few months like a few months ago we literally had a video where it's like man all soaps are the same and it was a terrible video like we tried to make a video about soaps and we just couldn't but well, now it's like completely different well i think we were late to the party you know what i mean yeah i think we were just late to the party on that yeah yeah you, you know what made me late to the party was i used a lot of touchless systems that were high ph and it fucked a lot of shit up so I said, at that point, I was like, you know what? I'm going to stop messing with these high pH soaps. But these high pH soaps now are coming out and they're so effective and they're so good. Uh, actually, Carbon Collective has one that I want to try that they've had for a while. And it looks pretty legit. It looks, it looks like you're getting results like super foam. So um, we're going to have to try Man, it out. Anything, anything that uh, we don't have to do the scrubbing. A little less scrubbing is always yeah. good. Yeah, even if it's just less scrubbing, yes. it's a big difference, you know, if some of these cars are beat up. Um, so here we go with the iron remover. Do you want to smell that one? Well, here's the thing. They're, they're talking that they hate the smell of iron removers. So I think it might be a good idea to smell it. Just smell it. Just do it. Man. If, if it smells bad, you got the bio bomb right here. Still nasty. <laughs> this smells like eggs. <laughs> don't do it, brother. I don't, why, man, why'd I listen to you? I don't know. I knew that was going to smell like shit. Uh, I, man, man, I got over here snorting. Bio bombs and Thor. See if he worked his bio bombs in the iron remover. Break it up. <laughs> Touch it up. <laughs> All right, so we have uh, interior clean right here. I'm going to smell this. We got the interior clean. I don't, I don't smell like nothing. No? No, no fragrance. Okay, well, here's the, uh, here's the one you were talking about, the rinseless. So get that one to smell. Rinselesses usually smell pretty decent. Oh, yeah, that smells like a, that smells, it smells clean. Okay, so this is a microfiber wash. It's nice to have. Got a mi microfiber wash in there. Microfiber wash, like as, uh, same. For the towels. Oh, rags yeah. to riches type the deal? Rags to riches, oh, good, yeah. Okay. Well, right now. And then we have a natural soap. That's cool. 
I'm going to have to read the directions to see how maybe it's just called natural. But if it's natural, that's even better. Might probably pH um, neutral, I'm guessing. That's maybe yeah, that's natural. Yeah, something that's biodegradable mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, maybe like a cast style base. Like, you know, the, the cast style soaps, Dr. Bronner's type of joints. Um, but yeah, so that's, uh, that is our packages from the House of Rags. So... Um, Anything particularly stand out to you? Let me see them coatings. Let me check them coatings oh, yeah. out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See go. what these all about. Okay. So black, I'm guessing they black got the, bottle. I think, I think it's called the slim and thick. No, slim no. thick. But you want a little bit of both to sl get the slim thick. I'm guessing uh, ones uh, has to do with the years. I'm guessing. I would think. Premium blend. Huh. Ease of use. I hope it. Uh, I hope it beads instead of flashing, like rainbowing. Mm. I like when they bead up and they sweat. Those ones are a lot easier to apply, but we'll see. Huh? Yeah. Okay. We'll do a little bit more research. Get back to you guys on uh, what everything is. We didn't get. Uh, there was nothing else in the. You know, there was just the, the, the order, but there was nothing, uh, no type of, uh, what's it? Uh, there was no type of literature included. So we're probably going to have to watch the videos to see what, you know, what, what the deal is with each one and uh, test them out. And we'll let you guys know. But of course, we're going to follow directions and everything. Um, you guys that use this stuff already, let us know in the comments what's your favorite how to apply it? You guys be our instructors. Yeah, what too. you like, what you don't like, what's working, what 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 you know areas of improvement. You know, it's only going to help them. It's going to you know uh, help others who are who are going to try to use it. So, yeah, let us know. But thank you, House of Rags, Eddie, Jamie. Thank you guys, um, and uh, we will uh, we'll follow up on this. We'll 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 get down to it and we'll see. But that's you know that's a good that's a good array of products right there. So, you definitely uh, make some money right here. Oh, yes. So that's it, guys. Our first unboxing and uh, detail co. Let us know what you guys think. When we were told it was being sent out, it arrived in a, in a timely fashion. It doesn't seem like there was no... I didn't get any notifications from the, from the courier that there was going to be any delays. Seemed like it went pretty smooth. So there was no... We didn't have any issues on our end. So for those of you who have been seeing the videos and stuff where you know where, where there's issues just so you guys know we did not have any and we're not paid to say that we're telling you the truth so um i think those are you know you know new company there's kinks it happens to pretty much everybody we've seen all the brands get hit that come out new right DIY, they, they took some heat when, when thing, you know, you have your little rough beginnings and it's going to happen. Haters. Pains. Yeah. Like we, <laughs> if you're watching this and you have a business, you've, you've probably gone through issues in your business where, where you've had hiccups or you needed improvement or something happened and you didn't forecast the, you know, the problems that could occur. So you got to go re go back, readjust, and, and fix the issue. So I think we need to have a little bit of grace with with anything that's new. You, you know, when a restaurant first opens, you have a little bit of grace. Oh, man, they're new. Everything's just starting. It's a little crazy. But you go back two weeks later, three weeks later, now there's just now it's not now it's not growing pains. Now it's problems. Right. So um, yeah, we had no issues again. But you know, people were roasting a ton of people when they come out about. The logistics of supply chain, you know how how things are, the turnaround times, the the you know the shipping. So Sal comes from that background in that world, so he's pretty critical with it. So this, this in with this one, we had no issues. So shout out to the House of Rags. But then again, we didn't pay for it. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if we paid for it, it'd be a different, you know, for full transparency, it was sent to us. You know, it was sent to us. Again, it was a guys. gift. It was a gift. So thank you guys. And uh, if you guys want detail code products, we told you we're always going to put the affiliate links in the in the description. And if you don't know why or understand why we do it, um, 
go check out the video we'll put at the end of uh, this video so you guys understand exactly why we put affiliate links in our descriptions. You know, and it doesn't matter what company it is, if we're talking about it, it's going in there. So we'll catch you guys on the next one. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share.